Hey guys, welcome to TFN and to our new set. As you can see, we have an orb. Without further ado, Google's been pulling out all the stops this week in mobile. In the course of just one day, they've overhauled two major products for mobile, Gmail and YouTube. Unlike Android users who enjoy fully integrated Google services on mobile, iPhone users have suffered through years of Google apps that have always lacked a certain je ne sais quoi, like easy search, multiple account support, a smooth interface, little stuff like that. But Gmail app 2.0 has all this and more. Here's what it looks like. Search is much improved and more intuitive in this version, thanks in part to search predictions that can facilitate finding finding that random email from six months ago that you suddenly need. The side swipe interface makes it easy to navigate between messages and your inbox, as well as other folders and other features like chats. You can also respond to Google Calendar invites in this app. And on an interesting note, you can also add scribbles to your emails for anyone who prefers to communicate in doodles or longs for the heyday of draw something. Perhaps most importantly, there's also multiple account support for up to five accounts for any of us who either use it for business or, you know, have multiple identities to maintain. We should also mention that Androiders running ice cream sandwich or higher also received a Gmail update on Monday with improved resizing, swipe to archive and more. Also this week, Google released a huge overhaul of their YouTube app optimized for iPhone 5 and iPad. They first introduced the app in September to replace the original native iOS app. First and foremost, Google says that the video should start playing much more cleanly. Because nothing was more annoying than wanting to show someone a quick clip on your phone only to sit through several minutes of excruciating buffering. The new app does seem to be markedly improved in that regard. One gripe, however, is that you will have to sit through ads just to get to the video, just like you would on the YouTube website. Nonetheless, both of the newly renovated apps, Gmail and YouTube, carry the same clean aesthetic that we expect from Google. Same font, same colors, smooth animations. If you remember that vintage-looking TV icon we were used to from the old native app for iOS, the new YouTube app is easy on the eyes and on your tap and finger. They're both also free. All of these updates have led to some intense speculation, among our staff at least, that the Google Maps relaunch could be just around the corner. And don't forget, we're in the middle of our tech feed holiday giveaways. The winner of yesterday's TFN t-shirt is Rufus Colby. He watched our video and left a comment about his favorite place to use social media. His response, in my house, doesn't really matter which room. That makes so much sense. Congrats, Rufus. And if you want to win your own awesome tech feed t-shirt, let us know what you'd like to see next from Google. Leave your response in the comments below and best of luck. This is Annie for TFN.